hey guys what's up it's frosty here in today's video we're gonna be talking about the luminar the luminar the, Lu the luminar if it's the best starter card in the game for 350 thousand it's pretty much i love it i'm stuttering right now but it's pretty much a really nice car i love it so much you guys see how it looks it looks so clean and it's only 350 thousand but is it the best car you can get for 350 thousand and that's what we're gonna find out in today's video personally I think it is just based on its speed and handling. Its speed and handling is pretty nice, and I'm gonna and I'm gonna show you how it drives. It's it's pretty good if I say so myself. Like, like look at this. And the thing about this car, it pretty much slides on its own like this. Like I'm not even oh dang, <laughs> I'm not even trying to drift or whatever. But like it'll like try to slide on its own. So if you're into drifting then this is this car might be the one for you like i really love this and i didn't really think i was gonna get it but once i customized it i fell in love with it that's the thing about um bmws in real life to be honest because this is what this is based off of bmw like stock they look clean or whatever but once you modify them they always look 10 times better like especially this one since i blacked it out i love i love bmw's blacked out they just look really clean or I would have done the Mariana Blue, which is the pastel blue in the game right now. That also would have been very nice for this for this car. Like, I can show you guys what that would look like right now. Hold on, so let's go ahead and go to the skins and let's try to find pastel blue. Pastel blue really does hit on this car. So where is this? We got the regular blue, but we're not really a fan of regular blue. Pastel blue be hitting. And if you guys are wondering how my game looks like this, it's called Row Shade on so it just enhances your game on roblox uh and you can turn it on and off whenever like this with well, a button yeah where's pastel blue hey i must have passed it because it's not showing down here i hate taking mad long trying to find a dang skin where's the search bar for this man all right uh let's see give me a second okay i found it this is what it looks like pastel blue it does hit on this car and here's what it looks like with the thing off it hits i love it but i also really love the blacked out look so yeah uh why is it i even equip it top ends yeah there you go i really love how this looks all right guys so i have cam here helping me and he has the mustang the mustang costs exactly 350k as well so you, they're both the same price we're gonna see which one's faster and see which one's worth it for the price so these are these are these are the both the exact same price and next we'll check over the charger the charger the charger goes for 375 and the challenger goes for 400k and let's see if the luminar can beat both of them all right let's check this out all right so the first race no boost so three two one go and it, it's straight down by the way just you're just going straight all right so this this is no boost by the way and i i have this man like in a bus link that's dang bro that's insane and that it's supercharged he has it supercharged okay i made i made it down here first all right and now let's try it with boost on our way back all right three two one go yo okay <laughs> yeah this this wins bro all right so this this car took on that mustang pretty pretty easily i'm not gonna lie towards the end with the boost it was low-key challenging but yeah we're about to find out if the charger can keep up with it along with the challenger all right guys so now dang Move that big old talk. <laughs> All right, so we have we have the Luminar versus the Dominator. We're gonna see how it goes. All right, remember that one's 375k. This is 350k. All right, three, two, one, go. All right. Well, all right. So this is pulling on the Dominator, by the way. I think I'm pretty sure he has his Dominator maxed out as well. Oh, oh my gosh. I think that's slower than the Mustang. No way. Weesh. I feel bad for y'all Mustang buyers. I really do. I really do. 
All right, and now on the way back, let's go ahead and hit the boost. So, <laughs> three, two, one, go. All right, see, I'm not even boosting yet. Okay, now I'm boosting, and oh, he he low key was keeping up. Oh, not anymore. Never mind. Yeah, he's gone. Almost smacked that guy. All right. Yeah. Oh, dang, he crashed into the wall. Jeez, boys. All right, guys. So this. This was 350k and it looks good all around. Two door car. Uh, yeah. All right. So now let's pull out the Challenger. Okay. So the one thing I really do love about the Challenger is it's startup. Uh, can you go ahead and start it up for me one more time? Listen to that. That's that pure v V8 engine in there, bro. That junk's nice. And it has its own custom driving sound, which is clean. All right. So no boost all the way down. Three, two, one, go. All right. Whoa. Why do I feel like they just get slower and slower? Okay, nah. This one actually does keep keep a good amount of distance. Not it's not as it's not as bad. It's faster than the Mustang. Oh, it, oh, it, ca it caught up in the top end. It looked like it was catch ca catching up. But the uh, Luminar has acceleration. That's for sure. All right, on the boost. Three. Two, one, go. All right, let's see. Okay. Oh, I passed them. No way. I was not expecting me to pass them. All right. <laughs> oh, he, <laughs> he jumped off the pier. <laughs> no way. All right, so like that one's closed, but you remember you're paying four, you're paying 400k for that. And that, that's an extra 50k while this is 350k keeping up and and pretty much beating that car. Well, all right, guys. So you've seen it. You've seen it here. Uh, the Luminar is pretty much worth it for the price. I would say it's 350k. It's a good, like, if you're looking to buy a car in a couple hundred thousands, this is the one to go. Like when I first saw it, like in the game, I was like, yeah. But then I was like, come on now. It's like realistically, it's BMW. They always look clean when you modify them. I modded this car out. Look how clean this looks, bro. Like I, I slammed it. I mean, even though the wheels going through the fenders a bit, but hey, it looks clean. You can't really tell. It, it just looks clean. Look at his. His has his has a stratosphere thing on. It looks like some ESR wheels. Dang, I I love it. Oh my gosh. So what do you guys think in the comments? Uh, is this car a W or an L? Comment down W or L. All right, guys, we're gonna be using the cloud emoji. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you guys hit the subscribe and like button and comment down the cloud emoji, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.